current understanding that we have about uh, covid is that this seems to be a bidirectional relationship between diabetes and covid right so covid seems to be affecting diabetes and in some way diabetes seems to be affecting covid right so this uh, we've seen both in the first wave as well as in the second right now if you have diabetes your risk of developing uh, complications from covid-19 become a bit more right it's not that you are more at risk of acquiring the infection but if you have acquired the infection your rate of complication or you know the problems due to the covid infection are much higher than if you don't have a diabetes than if you don't have diabetes now even patients who have diabetes if you have a patient who has diabetes and the blood glucose levels are very well controlled the covid complications are not that bad they are almost like a person who doesn't have diabetes so if your bl- blood glucose levels are not well controlled so the complications that you would have after you develop the covid-19 infection much higher right so this is the link between diabetes and covid now new data is emerging about the link between covid and diabetes whether covid actually causes diabetes or causes diabetes to get dysregulated just by happening so that's the new link and as we all know covid-19 is like a new disease we didn't know about this disease till 2 years ago so this is all new data that we are accumulating over the last one or two years and what data we have it looks like covid-19 could result in new onset diabetes in patients who don't have diabetes and there's also a subset of people who already have diabetes but they have never been checked in their lives and now as part of the treatment when you're checking the blood glucose levels you find that the person already has diabetes and it's just being picked up at the time of covid-19 so that's another group of patients who you have who are newly diagnosed with diabetes at the time of the covid-19 infection now there's also a school of thought that says that in a normal person as well covid-19 results in an increase in the blood glucose levels so there are several mechanisms uh, which have been proposed about this like something some people feel that the stress reaction due to the covid-19 infection there are certain factors which happen when you when the body is exposed to a stress like an like a severe infection like the covid-19 right so there are a lot of hormones which are released there's a lot of uh, inflammatory markers which are released inflammatory mediators which are released which actually result in a metabolic abnormality and the blood glucose levels go up some people also believe that the pancreas that we talked about it has receptors the ace receptors which we talked about and the virus goes attaches to these cells and causes damage to these cells and it doesn't let the pancreatic cells produce insulin right so we don't have hard evidence for this but we do believe that it can happen because there are several instances where other viral infections have resulted in the occurrence of diabetes as well so we feel that probably covid-19 can also result in new onset diabetes now the other important thing is that many patients require steroids to treat the covid-19 uh, disease now steroids are a very good group of medication but they have a very important side effect they cause your blood glucose levels to go up right so that's another cause uh, in which or a way in which covid-19 can result in a worsening of blood glucose level or a new onset diabetes in a patient who doesn't have uh, diabetes like and follow our page for the latest covid-19 updates